Hi, my name is Stella Seifer, Educational Technology Coach in Aurora, Colorado with Aurora Public Schools. And I love using Google. Currently, I teach teachers, kindergarten through 12th grade, how to use various Google tools within their classroom. Everything from Google Classroom to Fluguru, Doctopus, um, just getting kids to collaborate. It's one of the best parts of my job prior to this. I was in a uh, fifth grade classroom where we tried as many different technology things as we could. And I love teaching teachers how to use Google. And I really look forward to this opportunity to share my Googliness with you. So today we're going to be talking about creating interactive Google presentations. All of these use the same basic technique of providing links from slide to slide. But we're going to focus on Jeopardy to learn the techniques and then you can apply them however you want. So I've created the basic board on water unit. When you click on the 100, it takes you to a question. One click brings up the answer, what is melting? And I have a link to take you back to the board. So we have our beginning. Our first screen is the water unit knowledge Jeopardy board. Then we have a page set up. Here we have a link back to the board. So we're going to go ahead and build one more question. Typed in a question. The answer, of course, would be, what is a glacier? Make sure that it comes up when we want it to. We're going to go ahead and insert some animation on that. We want it to appear when we click a link. So I'm going to do a text box. And so in order to put those links in, we're going to go ahead and put insert down to link. And water unit knowledge it tells us the name. We apply that link. We're going to go back to this and we're going to repeat that. So then we're going to insert a link. And this time we want to go to vocabulary for 300. Click the apply button and now we have that link. Click takes us to our question and this link will take us right back to the water unit knowledge. So I hope you have an opportunity to create a more interactive Google slide where either you or the students at their desk can click through and choose a different path for their learning.